Yeah. None of the, you know, normally for like a fuse blows, one of them goes down. Yeah. It wasn't at all. Um, so all of them are up. This is a puzzling one. This is a puzzling one. Let's go upstairs now. This is weird. Hi there, Delroy here from Eastway. I'm off to a job this morning. I think it's a loft extension and something's not working. It's fault finding from what I understood. Yep, get in there, get on with it, see how it goes. I was away last week and then uh, came back and yeah. basically the upstairs light sockets and I think there's some kind of electric pump that's like takes the wastewater down. Okay. That's sort of, it's all stopped working. Um, but the downstairs lighting is fine. Apart from this one. Okay, so hello. You know on the circuit board thing? Uh, yeah. None of the, you know normally for like a fuse blows, one of them goes down? Yeah. It wasn't at all. So all of them are up. So all of them up. So all this is not working. None of it's working. Yeah. And it was while you were away. Well, it seems to be while I was away, but everything was unplugged. Like there was nothing there. <laughs> Weird. It was really weird. And then the other thing that was weird is that this there's a hallway light down here. And when I turned all the, the switches, I just thought, let me just try turning it off and turn it Yeah. When I did that, now this light turns my kitchen light on. What? I know. So, hold up. So, which one? This light down, down here. Maybe it's the thing, but if it doesn't do it. Turns your kitchen light on. Yeah, no, it's not. Hold up. Oh my goodness. So just, just a minute. Let's hold up. Go on, do it now. So this, this, last night, I promise you, this light... Yeah. I have, have witnessed... You <laughs> switch your thing switching on. Switching the kitchen light on. Yeah. And it has never done that before, and it's obviously not doing it again, yeah. so I don't know why. But okay. I just, I just don't well, let's have a look at the fuse board downstairs. All right, so let me show you. Because it may be... Some of these ones are quite funny in how they operate, you know? It's the converted flat as well. Yeah. Um, Your one's the one at the top, there, that yeah, one there. Yeah, so it's that, that one there. Feeling new. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, let's have a look. Like you say, everything is up. Yeah, they're all switched on. Yeah. So you'd expect everything to be working, wouldn't you? I know. This is the only thing that, I can, that I'm not seeing. Nope. 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 Yep, yeah, they're all up. Okay, that's a bit funny. It is strange, isn't it? Yeah, so. And also, that is only half of the height of the plug. Oh, God, I hate this test. I don't like this tester. Nothing. Oh, let me just check something. Uh, it's no volts. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Downstairs is working. Up here is not working. All the switches, all the MCBs, and everything are on. It's weird. It's weird. <laughs> uh, well, okay. Yeah. I'll tell you what I'm going to do, I'm going to get my, my step ladder yeah. so I can have a good look at that fuse board because that's where everything starts. Okay. So, because it's weird that you, nothing, you haven't, you've been away, yeah. you left everything working. Everything was unplugged, so yeah. nothing could have like... And then you come back now, it's not working. So what I really need to do, I um, need to get that cover off and have a look at it, okay. see what's going on. Cool. This board, actually, the way the buzz bar goes in, look at that. It's not very good. And also, it's MK, and they've got um, that looks like Wilex MCB in it. <laughs> everything seems okay as far as I can see. Yep, everything seems okay. Here, 
So I'm going to have to look upstairs now. This is a puzzling one. This is a puzzling one. Something very obvious, I'm sure. Must be something obvious. Because, as you can see, power is coming out. Yeah. Hold up. I just had this working. Hold up. Is coming out. That's all good. Everything seems to be all right there. Right, so everything seems okay here. Because if you check here, power's coming out. Let's go upstairs now. This is weird. Just make sure I'm not missing anything here. What I've just noticed is <laughs> this clever sparky. Now, that all these are old cables, yeah? That's a new one. That's a six mil. And, or is it a 10 mil? I don't know, six, I think, yeah. What I reckon this geezer's done is, look, he's put a 50 amp, <laughs> put a 50 amp breaker in there. What I'm thinking is, that loft could see the lady, she's on one of these conference calls and it's for about half an hour, which is, it's a pain really when you're trying to work. So I can't ask her because I don't know if she, she's been here two years, the leftist loft conversion was done before then, probably. And I'm wondering if that six mil is to feed the loft and somewhere up there hidden, there's some sort of switch that's tripped. This is what I'm thinking. And it wouldn't surprise me. Because he's, he's, he's used a 50 amp Wilex as well in an MK board. It doesn't fit properly, so you can't get the cover on properly. This is what I'm thinking. I could be wrong, but let's, let's see. Well, there's a shower, but that's not electric. And upstairs, there's a little bath. Hold up, hold up, me, hold up. I wonder, I didn't check if there's a shower over the bath, so I don't want to get too excited. It's the fridge. <coughs> Well, there's no shower there and this is a little miniature bath here <laughs> no shower so that 50 amp i'm thinking that there's some sort of isolator somewhere up here to do all this and they've fed it from a 50 amp which is totally unnecessary that's the only thing i can think of that he's come up to a switch he didn't need an RCD because he's already got an RCD, but he may, he may have put an RCD in. But where is it? I mean, that's the only thing that makes sense to me. There's nothing in here that would be on a 50 amp. You've got the oven, but I'm sure it's not for that. Right, I, I'm assuming you bought it with the loft conversion yeah. done. Okay. Right. This is what I'm thinking has gone on here. Watch out. See all these cables coming out your fuse box, yeah? yeah? These are all old ones, yeah? Right. Now this is a new one. Yeah. Which I am thinking, they've run that up to do the power in the loft. This is what I'm thinking. Because it was a new installation, so they had to get power up there yeah. and they've decided to run a new cable. But what I think they've done, somewhere up there, they've put maybe a miniature fuse board or a switch and that's tripped and that's why you've got no power this is my thinking because usually they've got a 50 amp fuse there which is much too much anyway but you haven't got an electric shower anywhere no. and your ob your oven is electric i take it but it wouldn't be that okay i'll tell you what just to make sure if you go and check if check see if your oven's on because I used it when I came back. Yeah, yeah just, just check it because because what I'm going to do, I'm going to switch it off to make sure that that switch is not for the oven. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay. Because that switch would be either for a shower or an oven. So tell me when you know it's on and I'm going to switch it off. Tell me if it goes off. If it goes off, then we've had it. <laughs> it's on, yeah? 
It's still on? Okay, cool. So now we know. We've got a fuse there, and I know power is going through the fuse, um, MCB, but we don't know what that does. Okay. It is not an electric shower. It doesn't do the oven. So my only conclusion is that does the power for the loft. Okay. But it's going to another switch or fuse board, but where they've put that. So that's why I need you to, I do want to start moving your stuff about yeah. without your permission. Oh no. <laughs> no, I don't think anything would be. Okay. The only thing I can think is that there's a, like a loft space behind oh. it. Oh. Do you think that's where it might be? Yes, because I've come across this before where the person put a, a, a switch in there and you wouldn't know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Because this is where the, I think, the pump is as well. Okay. <laughs> there was a yep, there you are. Is that it? Yeah, there you are. Oh, nice. That looks like it, the fuse board there. So if we can get some of this out. Yeah, yeah that's exactly what I thought it was going to be. And it's, you know, I'm pretty sure that's what's happened. All right, so this will be that. Let's see what they've done here. Oh. Right, see, what? <laughs> That's exactly what I thought. Well, I'm Alright. Okay, so your light should be on now. Yeah, it's yeah, look, come in here. And it sounds like the race board Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, that, that, that's working. That's See fine. this? Yeah. This is a little fuse board like the one downstairs. Yeah. And um, when, while you was away, yeah. something tripped. Something caused it to trip. Come here, look. Can you see that switch there? Yeah. Look, that one there. I can see it, yeah. Yeah, right. That one there is what's called an RCD. Okay. If the power goes off again, this is going to be down. Okay. And you just push it back up. Okay. But what I think, from what I remember, downstairs it's already on an MC RCD. From what? Yeah, it's already on. You've got a split board, I think. Yeah, you've got a split board and you've got two RCDs. And what do you think about that light downstairs then? What? The one that turned on a different light. Do you think they were just on? I don't know what that was about. Okay, it well. Itself, but... Yeah, well, we can have a look at it. But I, the thing is, wait till it happens again. Okay. Because I could be looking at something that's not there i don't know don't want to waste your time and money yeah. but you don't think it's unsafe basically that's what i was worried no about. no 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 so um yeah 